All right, guys, I'm super excited and you guys should be as well because here we have today the very first match I think we've ever seen this season and it's at a scrimmage held by Blink or one of the, uh, and this is the finals match and here, so they're from Singapore, pretty sure, and we have uh, 8076D, 8059A versus 8059E and 8059F and we're going to get straight into the match here looking at the robots. Um, I think all four robots are pretty standard front to backs so nothing really to be seen there. We're going to see the auto here. I think one of the robots don't have an autonomous routine while the other ones all do. The blue lines here having pretty pretty okay autos to fare up against the first seed. Unfortunately they, they do score a red block there into that it's that far tube that we see there, and you know, they're going to try to just squish one into these bottom tube. But I think Auto is going to is probably going to come to to blue. I'm pretty sure it's, I'm pretty sure it's a blue. Uh, let's actually make sure here. Mm. Yeah, so blood, I'm pretty sure Auto went, went to blue, and right away this blue robot down here finishes up scoring on that middle tube, while red dashes is scoring and. Uh, taking blocks out of the corner and then scoring, right? So, um, no, the, the the alignments aren't terrible. Definitely, I don't think they have alignment mechs, and it's definitely not terrible. And here they're finishing up taking out the blue balls or the blue blocks and just you know putting them down onto the ground. We're gonna back up a little bit and look at what this red robot does here, trying to defend the blue alliance from scoring a lot over here. The blue alliance does have control of that far control uh, tube right now, of the far control part. Which is going to get them extra 15 points. And here, Red Alliance is going to take advantage of this match looking tube. And really lock in on this bottom long tube. And score the whole thing pretty much. And Blue here is going to play, play defense. They have one singular um, block on there right now. And that's not going to do anything. It's not going to you know, really cause Red a problem. Unless they push these further in and knock the other balls out. Right? So... There's not a lot of descoring happening so far as people might think. So, you know, that's definitely um no, that's definitely a good thing to see here. But there is some congestion here, right here on the on the field. You can see that they were getting they were getting kind of stuck here, but you know, they were to, to get through and and blue here. Their intake is kinda of, kinda of getting stuck and red's gonna be able to play some defense on them if they want to, as they wish. But no, they they're not they're gonna go around and try to fight over this this sensor right here, this portion where there's uh, there's it's blue controlled, they're gonna try to fight over it, and they're gonna try to push the blue ball, the, the blue blocks out as best they could. And I, one thing I noticed the, that drastically ha happens during a match, during a match is that once you use your match loads, the scoring becomes so much slower because there's not really a way to. You know, get a ton of blocks super quick now and score a ton really, really quick. You have to really go around and get those blocks. And I also, also noticed was one of the team is one of the team's intakes definitely snapped. I'm pretty sure it's one of the red teams. I'm pretty sure it's this robot here. And you can see that red going for a final park here. Same with blue, but blue's not gonna hit their park. And you know, I'm pretty sure that went to the red there as we saw. And we're gonna have a finals match two here going up. I'm very happy that they actually did three finals matches so that you know, really showing um, kind of a high level at a very early stage. And I don't think this match, the autos did as well. So I think Blue's going to take the auto pretty substantially here. Red scored none, and Blue's going to take the auto. And now we're going to see, I think, a very similar strategy play out where this robot's going to come right here, take these three, and then just score them, while this one's going to... Do the same. I think. I think Red's gonna really focus on on match load stations, as I'm kind of proved right here, um, partially by the bottom red robot is very is trying a lot to use those match load match loads to score, but the top one isn't able to. And unfortunately, the red, the bottom robot is gonna score a blue block, as you can see there. I don't think it's really gonna do much for them. They have a pessimized. A uh, match loader, which like that, just scores or just grabs super super quick, and they're going to, be able to score this bottom tube almost to that middle section. And you know, I wonder how strong these uh, these match load tubes are, or the, these match load 
um, like mechs are because it, there's a lot of defense happening here in the corner that you, so you can see. And he has to kind of fight over both of these tubes now because their teammate, his teammate is not doing a whole lot but defense. So he kind of has to go around and fight for both tube control. And he's going to do a good job here getting a good lineup and getting two in. Unfortunately, zero cubes are in that center right now. But if Blue wants to score in this one, one thing that you do have to consider is if Blue wants to score in this bottom tube here, they will also push the red cubes into the middle, right? Either side they score on, they're going to push the red cubes in the middle. So uh, red is going to just play some defense here on that side with less red cubes. And it's going to you know, help them can, can gain control of this of this one still but they, they they need to get control of the the top one back right so i don't know how they're going to end up doing this they're going to need to hit, hit a park soon as well it's a lot of stuff to do here with not a lot of time and blue does have that uh that bonus so red is going to try to dash try to get that get to that park and and both robots are going to go for it and i don't think any of them pulls it off here with three seconds left he is struggling to get in and he gets in the box and blue also gets in the box too All right really close match here Actually, I do think, um, no, it was a tie. So, super close match. Finals three. We have Red still in still, still in the lead here. The auto showing that Red here actually does a little better on the auto this time. And ties it up, I think. Yeah, they're going to tie it up with that, that top scoring one. All right. I'm definitely certain you need quite a lot of precision this year with these autos. Because you have to line up that very tiny hole. And here, the red lines on the bottom. Once again, going straight away to take those match notes out and use them onto that, onto this bottom too. But Blue already knows. Blue knows their strategy by now. And Blue is going to dash over and block them from scoring. So Red's going to have to go up to the top one. Try to try to you know, make some maneuvers here. Try to dodge around them, dodge and weave. And try to get a quick scoring off. Right, This kind of reminds me of spin up. Uh, so those matches where you know five one five hour plays, Iron Eagles or four zero two B where they're just dashing on the field trying to get some shots off, kind of the same feeling where they're just trying to dash off the dash around the field and try to get to these four spots to score in these long tubes, right? Completely ignoring the middle cube, however, and you can see that I think the blue blue robot here, which is might be a little bit worse at scoring, try to push them some balls into that bottom mm -hmm. cube. While now they're trying to come over here and try to stop the red alliance from you know getting so many of those scoring elements from the match loading tube and that's very dangerous right you can see so much so much defense happening here on this one red robot who's been kind of the center of action here scoring again and again and you can see here blue doing a good job blocking them but their red alliance partner is also doing an amazing job helping right this red alliance here is blocking and also helping um block for for his teammate right so i think one play might be your you have to have your alliance partner kind of kind of kind of block for you as i as i say the alliance partner kind of pins their 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 scoring teammate here but i mean he's doing a good job and he's gonna need to need to park inside of that that zone and what one thing i did notice is there's a lot of balls in those zones especially your opponent balls in your zones right so that kind of re reduces the amount of scoring elements that you have i'm pretty sure red's gonna take this match pretty pretty easily here yeah they're gonna take this match and the best of three so anyways that is the that's the best of three finals for the blanks um tournament and you no know, props to them for hosting one this early and very nice we get to see some some very early matches going on and if you want me to do a, a more thorough in-depth analysis let me know but that's just kind of the commentary